What is going on, people? Welcome back. Hope they're not going to rough this over. <laughs> they might. Eh, we better put a door over there. Johnny here, and we are playing some Rim Hammer the End Times with the Skaven. I guess we can just check the rough zone. Oh no, we're good. And we found some more open area over here, as well as some glowstone. Try not... Uh, okay, we finished art research. And... Okay, there is some wood we can harvest, but just a tiny bit. There, we have another Skaven door in place. Let's get these blocks brought in. And that did not get me the wood I was hoping for. <laughs> Fortunately, it grows somewhat quick on this biome. Keeping my eyes peeled for food items. There's all kinds of crazy predators. It probably doesn't make sense to be running over here with alligators. <laughs> cheetahs another tunneler joined fantastic okay jump to location whoa it's another wizard <laughs> yeah that thing's uh, a little broke i also need to again this is yet to be reprogrammed i try to record a few few days work sorry one day three two or three episodes and then go do some work this guy's gonna need himself a nice big bedroom we'll start by giving him this one though and then we'll do some mining over here we're gonna give these guys big bedrooms because they're butt heads want want nice rooms let's go check that bio plague lore depressive gourmand doesn't do dumb labor Another old gunshot. These guys are just freaking plagued with old gunshots. But at least he's a good doctor. Eh, not a good warden. Not that it really matters so much. Ah, a cook. Not that we're doing any cooking. Construct is good. Uh, you know, I'm going to set him to grow as well. Mining is fine. Quarrying is fine. I should probably set these equal in case we do start a quarry. Crafting, two. Research, zero. Okay, I guess that's fine. All right, well, the smoothing's proceeding at a rapid rate. I'd like to take all these old doors out and replace them with the new Skaven door. I'm going to lose a bunch of material on that transition, though. There's a little bit of meat sitting there. I also like to track down freezing statues so we can keep our food from freezing, but at this point, it's just not happening. I might expand this, maybe make it even bigger and have a proper hospital, but really that just means beds right now. Not going to do this mining until the bedroom's done. So we continue to grow. I think having this much wealth, the wealth needs to be adjusted. So what it's doing, it's taking this 32, multiplying all the warp stone items around this thing within a 5 radius figuring out what the wealth on them is and then dividing that taking a quarter of it and then this just pulls a random number every time between 0 and 550 the higher the number the better the reward and if you're adding a quarter of the wealth of all the warp stone around like this is almost guaranteeing that we get a really good wizard every time so Ah, shit. I did a little bit more than I meant to there. Let's cancel this one. I don't know why I did that. And where's those shoddy-looking walls? Let's pop those in here. So it does blend into wood walls, but doesn't blend into stone walls, which is fine. Actually helps because it fits the Skaven vibe better, I think. It looks cooler that way. Well, let's get another door going in here. Let's get all these blocks dragged out. So there's the ramshackle wall versus a regular wall. I just started with this image and made it look crappy as best I could. All right, and then we're going to need some bed stuffs. And we failed the quest. Imagine that. And I haven't seen anybody sitting around staring at an end table for a while, so that must have been successful. Let's go ahead and smooth this room out. Come on, you can do it. There you go. All right, we'll get our wizard moved over there. Is this guy, he could be, there are warlords. This guy is a plague vermin, so that's 
Storm Vermin. So we'll get Katroik moved over here. There we go. And we still have at least three spots available for new people. Yeah, this fits the Skaven vibe perfectly, how it looks like it doesn't belong there. <laughs> I love that. It was unintentional, but there you go. That's a nice benefit. Gorilla 1. We do have that lemur lurking around. I guess we can give him a spot here. That's fine. And we still can't plant. That's not good. Add Bill. Let's make this forever. And let's do this forever as well. What about anything else? Cigarettes. If we ever get the ability to make cigarettes, let's do that forever as well. If we grow tobacco, you've detected a mining work site. We had pork rot right away. <clears throat> yeah, so we'll prep a room for the food storage in here. And we'll put a freezing statue in there should we ever encounter one. This is never going to get done. We don't care about it. How do these rooms turn out then? So that one is mediocre at 36. So is this one. Yeah, mm, it's fine. It's partially based on the quality of the beds and stuff. This is normal, normal, normal. Whereas this one is awful. <laughs> awful poor. <laughs> Jesus Christ, another joiner. So every three days, he's activate as well. And look at that. It's another fucking wizard. <laughs> All right, that dude's just going to have to get this bed. I need to, this will be the last episode I do today. I got to fix that thing. Like, it's getting bananas. You shouldn't have, like, ten wizards, right? <laughs> it's going to be fun when we get raided. It's got to be just handle. Nice work, friend. Construct. No. Hunt. Not going to matter. Grow. No. Mine. Yes. He's got a penchant for crafting though let's make sure we have that turned on do i want to prioritize any of these let's prioritize smithing crafting oh he's a badass researcher too we'll leave that low he's a decent miner all right so now we just need to get some more doors shoved in over here and these can get taken out slowly but surely this will come together. <laughs> Although, the fucking growth rate, it's bananas. I think we should probably... Why aren't we allow sewing? Oh my god, I had sewing turned off, and that's why we we're gonna freaking die. There's plenty of animals we could go on a hunting spree, though. I'm gonna, uh, we have another social fight. A lot of these dudes hate each other. So do we have any plant workers with any skill? Do you have a passion? You're a six. Magical delivery. What's that? Dowie cannon shells. <laughs> Is it worth going over there and risking Moida at the at least it's oh cool. At least it's nighttime. This troll is injured, but definitely gonna recover. Yeah, there's not a lot of food in terms of what the predators are producing right now. I was thinking of putting in more walls over here, using the dung walls, and then we can uh, create some kind of spot where we can use some of these magical effects to better benefit. So maybe, can I build across there? I could also just do a standard trap corridor, but I want, I'd like a room. I think I'm gonna weaken these walls too. I think right now they're a bit too strong for my taste. So we can get people to come in here. Now the problem is our wizards have to have a space to actually cast the spells. So uh, and Skaven don't have any such technology as embrasures. It just doesn't make sense to them. As far as I'm concerned, we're really ripping through what little meager wood supplies we have as well. That's not ideal. Let's put that there. And hopefully they'll roof that over once they get the doors put in. And then we'll have the wizard stand out here and cast all the magical effects that make people sick and injured in there. And then this door we should probably hold open. Maybe we'll hold open... I don't want to be freaking... Oh, so we did sort of make this thing worthless. <laughs> uh, 
whatever. I guess we'll just leave it we'll leave it there for now. I need to figure out how the Skaven defense is gonna work. With the magic, it's a whole different freaking world. Alright, we do have more points. I'm gonna hold this one open. So this dude, Zneel, has more magic points. He has two now. And let's go with the Cloud of Flies. You have two points. I was gonna do Traceless Demise. That'll instantly kill a pawn, but it does remove all their stuff. So you don't get a bunch of free shit when it when it goes off. Yeah. The wizards have gone bananas. We're getting too many wizards. But we could do some planting in here too for safety. But look at all the trees coming back. That's fantastic. And the dung walls are a great addition. Just free walls made out of poop. <laughs> we have been afflicted by flu once again. Not unexpected for this biome. Did that dude get tended? Not well, but he did. The Skaven should pull through just fine. I want these doors held open. Can we go over here and do something? How are we doing for components? We can nab this whenever we want, but... Hmm, hmm. I see no critters. I was hoping... For... Look how many freaking gorillas are over here. Hmm. Yeah, well, okay, fine. Let's, uh, let's get back on the research. I want everybody to get armored up. This is for robes, basic armor. We can do gas masks, helmets, padded armor, skaven plate. Let's mold their gear. That's packmaster armor, cage mask. Prerequisites not completed. We need to research plate armor for that. Ugh, okay. All right, we'll get there. Now, why don't you predators I wonder if I shouldn't push this wall back and then put the door maybe down. I want this room here, but I don't know what to do so I can continue to leverage this thing, which is pretty freaking strong. I feel like I'm wasting it right now. Salting spree again. That's a very common break around here. Starvation? What the fuck are you talking about? I don't have enough. Okay, so I guess I do have people that are ill. Let's go out and start bringing in some food. We're in desperate times here. I like how the dude that's starving has to come out and... Alright, not Traceless Demise. That's not doing me any good. Uh, let's do the troll. Alright, now he's plenty mad. Let's make sure we get him brought down before he gets to us, please. Some of these dudes don't have weapons. I need to get on top of that, too. That's not going to do me any good. He's already shooting Warp Lightning. Beautimus. Can we freaking stop with the insults? Finish off. Alright, the horse is fled inside. Alright, so somebody bring that in so we have some food. And then I'm going to go target these horses while I'm at it. Is this my critter? No. I'm going to hunt that dude. I don't even know if I have any hunters on, but if these horses go bananas. It could be bad. Pestilent breath. All right, only one of them went mad. <laughs> you skitter leap out of the way. You warp lightning that dude. You, I love the warp lightning. Pestilent breath that guy. That should. All right, down he goes. Where's that dude with the sword? You. You. Did it select the plant underneath him? Finish that off. All right, the other one fled. All right, that should be fine for now. I want somebody to go grab that horse. You, grab the horse. Uh, we have sick people, but it is what it is. All right, there's another critter just brought down. I <laughs> uh, couldn't... Oh, couldn't do the insulting. Fantastic. He <laughs> can't reach anybody, apparently. I wonder why that is. Oh, because they're sleeping. All right, now they're just going to get into a fight. This guy took it on the chin. He's got a toe bitten off. You're going to get to rescue that dude now, friend. Uh, and we have two people that need tending, but I think this guy will self-tend. No. Bio. No medical. Jeez, Louise. This is Neil. Tend. Would you go lay down and 
if I can get tended as well, friend. Before this gets any more out of hand. Just notice we can make a gong. It'll give us a nice recreation. What's that require? A hundred metal, fifty wood. Let's not make it out of Grom roll. <laughs> I don't want the wealth around here to get any more crazy. <laughs> and we have this tailoring bench. This should be fixed now, so we should have all the scaven clothes in it. I fixed that last time. Make robe. That's not a scaven robe. Slice cap. So I think we're going to end up researching. This just allows us to make robes. Scaven apparel is not very nice. <laughs> Let's make some rag tunics. And we're clocked again. Now what? Complex robbing. Yeah, whatever. Let's make like five of these. I'll make some robes next. Infection. Now that's a problem. Okay, he's getting tended right away. And these dicks are here too. Let's slow it down. That's a lot of dudes. Maybe I can make these horses mad. See, now I've boned myself because I can't make proper use of this. So what I need to do is get them in here and get my magic off on them. This dude is down and out, but that's fine. I don't know how long they're going to prepare for us here. We do need to get some food going, which we did get that done. Fantastic. All right. Look at this dude's mental state. Fuck's sake. With the insulted already. Ouch. It's painful. This guy is not doing well. Uh, is it the infection or the flu that's killing you? He's good on that. He's good on that. Let's just leave him in bed when we go fight. It should be fine. And... Let's get over here and get ready. Should have added a door on the end so I could squeak through as well. Alright, so... You... Over there. You aren't really doing squat. You can be sort of a lure. We have Traceless Demise, actually. Oh, let's send him out to cast his spell over there. That'll be useful. Didn't I have somebody else that had air? Yeah, there we go. Air of Pestilence will do some good there. All right, you with this over there. Now boogie back inside. Ah, take that, you fuckers. <laughs> All right, well, that softened him up a little bit. Maybe they'll get infected and die of their own accord. Alright, so you're going to pop out of there. I wonder if it makes sense to cast the spells early. And how many of these guys do I have? You? Okay, so it's just two, and it looks like the lore I'm interested in is the plague lore. Indeed. So let's put him there and him there. Uh, this guy was just going to distract. Traceless Demise will be useful. I think I'll send you down there. This guy has no weapons. What should you have? A melee. Good. There's a badass Dwarven Axe right there. Go get it. What can you do? You can also Traceless Demise. That's nice. You're a shooter. This dude has nothing. Do you have any kind of shooting weapons? Just a bunch of poor Ungorbos. <laughs> oh. That's a, yeah, that one's shot there. Go equip that and come back if you would. This dude's like ready to hold the gate though. He's badass. All right, now if these frickers would just come for me, life would be good. And again, I need to figure out how to work that in. There's a tantrum. Hope it's not one of the guys I was really waiting on. Okay, so you, cloud of flies, you, pestilent breath. Oh, that has to target a pawn? That should be able to target locations. Can you target a plant? No. Oh, that sucks. Oh, no, I want air pestilence. Never mind. No, stop what you're doing. Do that. And then these guys will jump out of the way. <laughs> All right, so there's that. That'll... And then you... You come over here. You can traceless demise from behind people. Oh, shit. Where are they at? We better get out of the way of the poison here. <laughs> I didn't really consider that. All right, you. Let's slow it down so we can keep things moving. Traceless demise. All right, they're already taking wounds. What are you doing? Remember when I was like, hey, cast that spell and you fucking ran over there? And we're getting, becoming victims. All right, that guy got traceless. All right, this is injuring them. 
Get out of the way. It's creeping through that door. Pestilent breath. That guy. You. Attack. You. Uh, skitter leap out of the way in true Skaven fashion. You. Two arms. You. Right. You can do a traceless demise yet. Anybody looks... Oh, that guy jumped. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, I wanted this guy. Traceless demise. This guy looks like a bastard. You melee attack him. Alright, we didn't get to cast our spell. Well, maybe we did, but he died. Now it's wasted. Alright, you go get that guy. All right, this guy needs to really get on top of swinging that giant dwarven axe. Uh, maybe we should clear out of... Okay, see, our walls, they don't last for squat. Let's, uh, let's go... Those guys are in the shit, so they should... Ugh. All right, there they go. Melee attack that guy. All right, well, we have food aplenty now. Everybody on draft. And let's actually haul these butt sniffers. Well, I think I actually did the wrong thing with the drafting. There you go. Off you go, friends. Nobody go in there. <laughs> They're taking wounds from this. Oh. Here, let's see if we can't drop this idiot, too. This guy went down from the cloud of flies. <laughs> So that is effective. We just have to. Have... Thing is, if you had embrasures, it wouldn't be as effective because it would dissipate faster. Do not strip this cat. Just haul him. Okay, there you go. What's this cat? He's just hiding out down there. I think we might need more hospital beds. We took a fair number of wounds that time. And medical. And come on, orders. Let's deconstruct this. Mine this out. All right, there we go. Is everybody this guy is suffering all these wounds? We should probably make it a point to avoid that. These need to get put in so these walls get rebuilt. All right, I want to see if the poison's out here. It is. <laughs> it's not very effective, but let's see. Are you getting affected by it? You are malnourished. See, the flies are way more bastardly because they do. All these little wounds to him. All these little bites. Where are you going, dummy? Uh-oh, what happened? Oh, he went into the flies. <laughs> eh, whatever. It's fine, right? Let's get everybody healed up. Are y'all laying in bed? You are. You are not. Why not? Because yeah, you're hungry. Alright, that's interesting. Where's this guy at? Um, I see. <laughs> what do I do about this issue? Is there an air tossing? No air. He's just getting up and falling down. Oh my god. This could be the end. This <laughs> we, we might have grown too fast. And, uh, oh, it's fuck. It's another scaven bunch of bastards. All right. So you, I need somebody to tend this, bro. All right. Hold on. I might be able to deal with these dicks. That's not going to do me any good. Pestilent breath. Who's that cloud of flies? This guy. Okay, good. All right, and then... Oh, you fucking... You need time to recharge it. Bastard. All right, well, let's do air pestilence. That'll still mess him up. Let's we'll keep all of our people over here. <laughs> Where are you going? You're not going over there. I can tell you that. I need to make a zone to keep them out from over there. I don't know how far that's going to spread either. So, All right. Uh, one of my people got into it with them. Can you do anything else to help us out here? Infecting gaves, great red pox, cloud of flies. You could skitter leap and traceless demise. Snats elk is boned. Big time boned. Are they suffering any ill effects from this? Yes, they are poisoned from poison gas. Maybe we should get up and go to battle here. All right, the lemur's attacking. Thank God for that guy. Look, he took them both down. Oh, I bet it's because they're poisoned. Fantastic. All right. Can I force finish offs here? These bastards coming to try and kill me. All right, they've all gone down, which is good. We do need to get this guy rescued before he croaks. We do need to get out of here. <laughs> all these doors open. <laughs> Desperate times. 
All right, this guy, are you affected by it at all? No, good. Go rescue that dick. Get on out of there. I don't know how long they'll stay, stay down either. Uh, the Sleemer is going to be in trouble. Nice, seems fine. 34%. Okay, we should probably get somebody to go through and start whacking these fools. All right, I'm just going to do a bunch of finish-offs here. All right, that should do it. If this is telling me... What the fuck? He died? Died from poison gas. Where's Nats Elk? Is this him? It is. Oh. He was recovering from it, though. What happened? I don't understand. Cause of poison gas. I'll be damned. Health. But he's only at... I don't know what percentage. It says moderate and recovering. <laughs> All right, we better keep an eye on this guy. All right, out you go. Out you go. Let's, can we get over here and hold these tunnels open? Is the poison gas affecting? <laughs> it is. It is diminishing. I really, if I had a way to vent these areas, I would, but we don't. I do need to get over there and take those tunnels out. Are you affected by it at all? No, good. Come over here and drop these tunnels. Seems to have fully dissipated now. So I think we're alright. Alright, that's one way to deal with some Undermountain bullshit right there. Huh? Alright, and schedule unrestrict all. Okay, and then double check. I'm not seeing any poison gas. Now we do need to start burying. I think we can probably just consume. So, oh, we just don't have anywhere to put the guy. Expand zone. Actually, we'll just end up putting them in here along with food stuff, so that should be fine. I don't think they'll even care that he's not buried or that he croaked. <laughs> oh, yeah, they do care, just not very much. Well, we'll see what happens. Skaven, Molder, Goods, Trader from the Under Empire. And we also got a bunch of new weapons, and let's get these things put in. Our dung walls need to be rebuilt. <laughs> what a different dynamic, man. How fun. All right, so who's our best warden in here? This guy. Go over there and trade with this dude. Hopefully they have some slaves. I do see some humans there, but... I can't talk because of freaking poor health. They do have a bunch of wolf rats. All right, anyways, next guy on the list. I should probably check before I send him over there. We never get inspirations with these guys. All right, you can talk. All right, so they do have some Skaven slaves. Well, one slave, two people that would join as a colonist. This I've been waiting for for a good long time, so... I'm going to keep the gold. Never know. We might want to build something out of it. We have these Dowie artillery rounds. Troll heart's not going to last. Gromrel. I'd like to get rid of that, but I think we're going to make some badass armor. <laughs> All right. Let's just get through a bunch of this stuff. I need to keep something. I'm going to... Hold on. First, we need to figure out if we want to buy anything. Oh, yeah. Let's look at these dudes. Almost doesn't matter what the misandrist and ugly. You see, that guy's pretty bad. <laughs> Fisherman, misogynist, iron will doesn't do frack all. What is your... You're not a magician either. Oh, these guys are awful. We can take this dwarf as a slave. That might be interesting. <laughs> Creepy breathing pessimist. I don't really want to deal with someone that's going to join as a... Eh, these guys are too expensive for what they are. So we'll buy components. Do you have any medicine on you? That, I don't, the Skaven just don't deal in medicine. That's become apparent here. And if we could get some rat wolves going. All right, that should be good. We're not really growing fast enough that it would warrant. All right, we're growing fast enough without purchasing those slaves. That's what I meant to say. No one's cleaning, but oh, cool. We got some of these lights. Where can we put those babies? Reinstall one. This room is pretty well lit already, but I'll put that in there. And, I don't know. Should make little alcoves so I can stick these in the hallways. Oh, how about the hospital? Probably be a good thing, right? And these ones will burn out, though. I don't, they only last 40 days, whereas the ones you make yourself will last forever. 
Oh, hey, we got all these rat. We, you know what? We have tons of meat. We don't really need to go that route. <laughs> I think it's fine. We just need a freezing statue to stuff in there. Hey, our gong was finished. It's made out of steel. So let's get that bad boy put in. Put a couple of rotates. Pop that right there. There you go. New rack. Now somebody come around and bang on it so I can hear what it... I forgot what noise I put to it even. It's been so long since I implemented that. Uh, I think you now everybody's unrestricted, so... Next play. Oh, gosh darn. Cheers to the patrons. James Varley, Cody Rell, Roses and Sabres, Private David, Adam Shesnowski, Arkinix, Benjamin D, Carrie Mahoney, Cornell Boder, Dimitri Rurikid, Genghis Keith, Ginger Vitus, Michael Sager, Patrick Johnson, Michael Barrett, Reese Sox, Sebastian Schaefer, Shiggy, Stephen Raya, Nataziel, Gunnar Orn, Ragnarsson, Alex Scott, Archmajos, Doug Meyer, Mike Rakestraw, Mike Ferrero, Escape, Zazzle, Samantha Rank, Brad Weiss, Garrett, and Jehehe. I could... Nice, another fucking tunnel joiner. I could lure all these guys into a room and hit them with the poison somehow. Another fucking wizard. Okay, I'm not going to play anymore after this episode until this stuff's resolved. Fantastic, though. I'm not going to complain. We do need another bedroom, though. I've been doing these massive bedrooms, too. This guy needs one. So I guess we'll see what we can do for 8x8 eight eight over here. Why don't we go 7x9 there? Maybe I got a little overzealous with the size of these bedrooms, too, in all honesty. But we're committed now. These guys feel important. They need a big bedroom. And work. Yeah, I'm going to definitely reduce that as... A it's awesome. It's kind of. It should be fun. This guy's not gonna be a hunter. Uh, construct, I guess. We finished complex clothing. I need to get through to the armor. And I don't know. Your skill level three. That's not very good, friend. I'd almost rather be doing plant work or something, but I don't want to distribute the plant work around too far. Another researcher should make another freaking research bench. This does light most of this whole room. Critical alert, major break risk, needs. Intense pain, sick. So the flu, he has developed an immunity. He's missing toast. Dude's pretty, <laughs> we're getting pretty beat up, as you would expect Skaven to. Still have two unowned, three, scratch that, unowned bedrooms. So this wizard over here should claim one of these. I left this open so I could run a tunnel down that way. Still no medicine going in the ground. Plenty of meat, but it's not going to last long. Funeral expected. Didn't we butcher that putz? Uh, how are we supposed to have a funeral for a dude we butchered? You have the equipment to do research, but have not selected a project. There he is. What? Colonists are in a poor mood and may have a minor break at any... What the hell? I want to see this funeral thing. Okay, I guess there's just nothing for it. I don't even know where the dude ended up. I think we butchered him, though. <laughs> oh, it's, is he over here? No. I mean, we could put a grave in and see if he ends up in it. Grave? Let's put that in here somewhere. And then if somebody ends up in there, we'll have a funeral, but I'm pretty sure we butchered him. So that might be an oversight in that. No one's played the gong yet either. That's a little weird. I can hear the sound, but... Toggling that, they like to come and look at it, but no one's actually played it yet. Well, anyways, please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I appreciate you guys being here with me today. Once again, it's been interesting. Why is that not getting mined? Now we need to mine these two. It was a fun play to poison our own tunnels. <laughs> that was most interesting and effective. So there you go. All right, we're going to need more bedroom furniture down here. All right, anyways, that's it. I have to go for today. There's stuff to do, sadly.